Paul, do you have any thoughts then about how these decisions are made around what parameters you consider in your design process and also what metrics you're optimizing for versus just watching versus constraining based on? How do you make those decisions? Um, I think based on our experience, it's probably best to just uh, record as much data as possible, even if you don't think you're going to use it. Um, it's, it's still better to record it because you might later come back to it. But uh, I think as Vish said, a lot of those decisions, I think, are based on your physical intuition, just your experience in working with the design problem or the material. Um, but yeah, I think a lot of times your physical intuition can be wrong. And uh, that's why it's, it's best to um, keep the problem as open as, as you can um, and allow the uh, Bayesian optimization to, 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 to guide the process. Um, yeah, I think um, even just uh, a lot of people just simply just using their physical intuition, I think, can make, uh, you know, come up with very new designs or new products and such. But um, it's, still, it's still, I think, fairly limited. Um, and uh, I think by by working together with uh, Bayesian optimization, we can we've shown that we can come up with uh, much better designs, much better uh, properties and functionalities.